Alright guys, welcome back to a brand new Call of the Wild video. Today, we're going to be going headfirst with the 300 Magnum versus the 338 Magnum. A few weeks ago, we did the 470 versus the 338 out here on Verhanga, and we shot a couple Cape Buffalo, tested the penetration, and that's basically the same exact thing we're going to be doing today. First up, I do have the 300 Magnum on me, and then later we're going to swap over to the 338 and do some comparing. Mainly just going to be comparing the penetration that we can get at certain ranges we do have some cape buffalo over this hill so i'm going to try and get right at about 150 ish meters and then we're going to take a shot but we have this female right here that's standing perfectly broadside she's pretty much the only one that's going to give us a really good shot right now so i think we're going to go ahead and take it she's 170 out we're just going to go from right here put it right there and put a shot into her let's see exactly what that's going to do for her now obviously one of the advantages the 300 magnum has over the 338 is the ammo capacity and it being a bolt action instead of just one single shot you have to take an animal you have four so it definitely allows you to have a chance to throw up a couple follow-up shots a little bit faster if you have to especially if you're hunting these larger animals like the k buffalo hello uh it's always nice to be able to throw up a secondary shot or a third shot if you have to put two in her there quick tip if you're ever getting chased by buffaloes stand in the water they can't get you same thing for the wolves first off let's grab the one that we just shot that wanted to kill us and then we'll go grab our other one well at 25 meters we got a flesh hit that didn't barely penetrate her at all it literally did not go into any organs at 25 meters somehow and then at 27 meters we just barely got a right lung hit it went just enough into her right lung halfway through her and that's only at 25 meters so honestly that really makes me feel like there's not going to be much penetration at all on this other female that we shot we did get the vital organ and she did not go very far at all so this actually makes me wonder where did i even hit her well we actually just right longer and she died very very fast i mean we barely even hit her too you can see the penetration there just barely went in behind the shoulder blade here and just barely punctured the lung and she did not take very long to go down there at 178 meters so you can already see the 300 magnum does not have that much penetration but it does have just enough well she's 150 she's alert might as well take the shot while we can quite a few over there Definitely gonna hit that eight mythical with something. He's getting aggressive too. Well, there's two shots into him. We can't shoot him anymore unless we want to ruin the check. So hopefully we made a, at least some kind of solid shot. I do see our other one down right here in front of us. And this guy is not dying. Well, we already screwed him up then, I guess. I do like the iron sights on the 338 though. They are pretty nice and simple and they make it very easy to uh, make shots like this here close range we probably did ma manage to mess up one of the checks on this guy but i mean not the end of the world exactly what we did flesh hit him 232 meters out had not enough penetration to even hit his lung that sucks i honestly feel like the 300 magnum would have done the same exact thing but once he got up here to about 23 meters we did seeing along them let's go check out our female it'll be a little bit better comparison to the 338 or to the 300 sorry all right here's our female and we single lung her at 152 meters out given we were a little bit closer it honestly looks like the exact same amount of penetration as we got with the 300 magnum so i mean if you're trying to figure out if you want to use the 300 magnum or the 338 it really is just personal preference if we want to compare statistically the 300 magnum has a 42 penetration and a 14 expansion and its recommended classes are 7 to 9 and the 338 has a 16 expansion and a 45 penetration so statistically the 338 is slightly better but from doing some real world comparisons the 300 magnum 
is going to do just fine and honestly probably be your better choice just because you do have a four round mag instead of just a single shot rifle so which one do you prefer the 338 or the 300 let me know in the comment section down below i think i definitely prefer the 300 magnum over the 338 just because i'm a huge fan of bolt actions and the 300 magnum has never really let me down too much hopefully you guys enjoyed this video let me know if you want to see any more versus style videos like taking a certain gun and comparing them against another i like doing these these are a lot of fun i feel like they're also very informative for the community to help them decide which guns they need to use out there in the wild if you guys did enjoy this video be sure to smash that like button subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you all in the next one later